Welcome to this tutorial on how to calculate the days between two dates in Excel. This is a common task that can be helpful for variety of purposes. In this video, we will show you two simple methods for calculating days between two dates using Excel formula. So let's get started. This is the sample excel sheets. Here you will find two columns of start date and end date. See? Simple way to calculate dates between two dates is by simply subtracting that start date from the end date. So for that, select the cell where you want to calculate the dates. Now in formula bar, type is equal to select end date cell minus Select start date cell. After that, press on enter. And here you will find the number of days appeared in the cell. So, this is the basic subtraction method that can be useful if you prefer a simple approach. Okay. So, now if you are looking for a specialized function to calculate the difference between two days, the date difference function is quite powerful. So, date diff stands for date difference. It calculates the difference between two dates in terms of days, months or years. So let's see how to use it. For that, select the cell where you want to calculate the dates. So now in formula bar, you have to type is equal to date diff, open parenthesis, then select start date cell, comma, then select end date cell. Once again put comma, then st start double inverted comma, type D and double inverted comma and open the parenthesis. D means unit of time. So where it is a, here it is a days. Now press enter and the result will appear in the cell where you entered the formula. See? Now if you want to calculate only months between two dates, you can use M in unit parameter to get the result in months. So here you will find only the months. And in the same way, if you want to calculate only years between those days, you can use Y in unit parameter to get the result in month. So see here you will find the only year, that means one year. So this is how you can calculate days between two dates in Excel. So that's it. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and stay tuned for more helpful tips. Thanks for watching.